Welcome back to New Rockstars. I'm Tommy Bechtold, and the finale of the extended season 10 of The Walking Dead gave us one hell of an origin story for everybody's favorite villain, Negan. Ooh, he's so evil. Ah, God, you hate him, but you kind of love him, and that makes you feel conflicted. This episode actually gave us more insight into the character than the comics ever did, but as the show often does, some big changes were made in the transition from the page to the screen. We've seen some Negan changes before, like how in the comics, Negan only bats Glenn to death. <laughs> Glenn. But on the show, he gives the skull thumping to both Glenn and Abraham. After viewing the season 10 finale, we've got some more changes to Negan's story. Let's dive in. First things first, Negan's trademark leather jacket was given a proper origin story on the show. Negan drops 600 bucks on a jacket and Lucille isn't happy about it. Let me tell you, if you're spending 600 bucks on a jacket, it better be a Buffalo Bills vintage starter jacket. Otherwise, you're paying too much. And also, let's talk about the fact that you need to talk through big financial decisions with your life partner. Partner. But it's just a trick. She hides the leather jacket in a crawl space, making it the perfect gift post-apocalypse. And aren't we all looking for the perfect gift for our lovers as soon as the apocalypse is upon us? You know, for me, maybe it's a dozen roses or a flamethrower. In the comics, he just kind of gets his jacket uh, by grabbing it from a story he's passing through one day. Speaking of the comics version of Negan, this video is brought to you by The Walking Dead Survivors, the brand new mobile game available for pre-order now from the link in the video's description. The game storyline is pulled directly from the original Robert Kirkman comic so you encounter all the iconic characters like Rick, Michonne, and even Glenn. He's back and he's in this game. You live through classic moments and visit fan favorite locations all within the world. Think you could survive and build a community in the Walking Dead universe? Then prove it, tough guy. In the Walking Dead Survivors, you gather supplies, explore new territory, recruit new heroes, and become the leader of a settlement. You also kill lots of walkers, of course, so that sounds like fun. The game allows for all kinds of strategy, whether you want to focus on diplomacy and building a clan with other players, or go on the offensive and take the fight to Negan and his saviors. Build an army and fortify your base, though whatever you do, remember the ultimate zombie lesson. The walkers are dangerous, but it's the other survivors that are the real threat. It's the kind of paranoid, distrustful of humanity mindset that has kept me going for years. And the zombie apocalypse hasn't even happened yet. I have so much bottled water at my house, guys. Please, come drink some of my water with me. Follow the game on social media from the links in the description to see any updates, and you can download the game at the link below. On the TV show, Lucille the Bat also gets an extended origin story. Lucille the Bat comes from Laura. She wants to make sure that Negan can defend himself as he makes his way back to Lucille. In the comics, he just gets the bat from a random dead person. Well, the comics are really just like, Negan, do your thing. We want to find you when you're evil. We don't want to find out what led you to that point. Like the leather jacket, this iconic item is given much more meaning on the show. The saviors have an altered origin story on the show as well. Negan runs into Laura and her father, Franklin, who is a doctor. He's trying to get some meds for Lucille's cancer and they help him out, and then he, of course, sells them out to save his own ass. Typical Negan. He comes back to save them after he finds out his wife is dead, and thus begins the terrible journey of the saviors. In the comics, Negan runs into Dwight, who invites him back to his camp. This is the group he winds up taking over and turning into the saviors. In the comics, Negan is unable to kill his wife, Lucille, after she dies of cancer in the hospital and turns into a walker, so he gets a boy in the hospital to do the deed for him. In a later one-shot comic titled Negan Lives, released in July of 2020, Negan returns to the hospital to collect his wife's bones and lay them to rest like any good husband would after your wife has been turned into a zombie and you hire some kid to kill her. Romance isn't dead, but Lucille certainly is. As we saw in the show, Lucille overdoses on pills to make sure that she's no longer a burden to Negan as he keeps risking everything to keep her alive. Negan is unable to dispatch his dead wife up close and personal, so he burns the whole house down instead. You want to know what love is? Let Negan show you. Burning down the house for the ones you love. <laughs> Negan's future on the show looks to be very different from what we know in the comics. In the season finale, we saw Carol take Negan out to a secluded cabin in the middle of the woods. She says the Alexandria Council voted to exile him, though in a featurette for the episode on AMC+, showrunner Angela Kang confirmed that the decision was made by Carol alone and not the council. Very sneaky, Carol. This will surely set up some tension for season 11 as Negan's whereabouts become an issue for the town of Alexandria and certainly Maggie. In the comics, Negan lives out a life of solitude and personal exile. The final issue reveals that Negan lives lives in a house removed from the rest of the gang. In Negan Lives, Robert Kirkman said he was going to have Maggie finally kill Negan, but one of his artists and collaborators talked him out of it. We'll just have to wait and see if the future for Negan in The Walking Dead show is a killing blow from the ever-resentful Maggie. Get him, Maggie. You can support this channel by checking out one of our great merch options at newrockstarsmerch.com. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Tommy Bechtold. Follow New Rockstars and subscribe to New Rockstars here on YouTube for breakdowns of everything you love. Thanks so much for watching. See you next time.